fishing at Twin Gates today. I uh, said I'd do a video here. So I decided to come with Liam today. Um, it's pretty bad weather. It's not too windy, but uh, the rain's bad. Um, so I've just set up. Liam's just had a fish on, but it came off as I was setting the camera up. I don't know well you'll be able to hear me. So I've not tried this camera proper outside yet. Um, and I don't know if the rain's affecting it in the wind. Yeah, he's just had one on, I think it was two grains of sweet corn. I'm fishing pellets. Yeah, I'll show you what I'm using now. Right, so the bait I'm using, uh, I've already mixed my ground bait. Sorry, I've already mixed out some water. So that's fine, I'm gonna show that. The ground bait I'm using, I've used it all up, but I've kept the wrapper to show you. See, so, uh, dynamite, dynamite, bait. Marine halibut method mix. Um, I'm not going to start saying that this is the best bait for this kind of water and this kind of colour of water and this kind of day and all that bullshit. It's just fishing bait. I'm not asked what it does. Just because it says carp, but I still catch roach. Um, two kilogram bagger. Yeah, I think that was about six quid. Uh, with the ground bait as well as the water, mixing this uh, Scopex flavour stuff. It's uh, Sonia Bates. Uh, Obviously won't focus, but it says you can use it with pellets, paste, ground bait. Um, boilies and meat and pop-ups, I think that says. Oh no, particles. We could use it with pop ups actually. Miss that off. Well, that's in the bilies. Uh, anyway, so I'll put a bit of that in for extra aroma. This is the actual hook bait I'm putting on. It's on your baits again. These are just some uh, hookable pellet things. But I'm putting them on a quick stop. 11 mil. Uh, these are really oily. These are how big we are. Right, we just squeeze one. See our oil coming out. Full of oil. I've had quite a few carp on these before. I've only started using them recently, but since I've been using them, they've been working pretty good. For all that thing. Um, what else have we got? Oh, I'm. oh, I've got a fish on. Is it still on? Yeah. So I'm back down now, I uh, got my rod back out after uh, losing that fish. Uh, got a time it better for getting a bite. Rod nearly went in, went right around. Anyway, what was I up to? Oh yeah. So, if the uh, pellets stop working, we're working at the moment. Anyway, I'm going to use this cat food. Just use the uh, chunks. Chunks in jelly with tuna. I've never used this bait actually before, so I've seen a lot of YouTube videos on it. So I will be trying that. 
Uh, oh yeah, this is just in case we're not around there. I've got some of these pellets. Um, I've used these for a while. You can um, get a big bag of these. I think, I think it's a two or three kilogram bag for one pound ten. So I don't think you're going to get cheaper than that. Um, not from fishing shop, from a pet shop actually. I think they're for uh, feeding cattle and all that. Oh, what for? Sheep maybe. Oh, oh, but the work, you, the more of a stodgy mix. Just bulk up your ground bait, you know, if you're getting sharp. But we have worked before. You can add some scent in to uh, make them more attractive because you don't smell about really. And also, I've just got this sweet corn here. Uh, I've not mixed this without, just as it is. I might mix some of this aroma, I don't know, yeah. It's sweet enough anyway, I suppose. And uh, we're going to cast his rod again. Get a shot of that. So he's casting against that back wall. And letting his line settle and then he'll tighten up. We have fishing on this platform. It's a bit dodgy and stuff, you know, through this, this gap. Uh, there's the other guys in the spot. Over there. there. That's where I usually fish. And I fish where that blue thing is, but I'm against some trees. I'm trying to spot an OFC there. So yeah, try to get another fish. Right, Salim just got a fish. Uh, I was getting knocked on my rod. Uh, I'm, I'm on the cat food now, trying that for a bit. Is that on sweet corn? A little and it doesn't matter. Right, so it's a little, what is it, a common, a mirror? A little tiny mirror. I'm only getting a still because it's nice condition. Uh, I'll just get a still of it. Where's a ranch, bro? I got sauce in my city. And I ain't stopping till my crib got a pool in it. Basketball court with 20 rooms in it. Movie theater remain with big boobs. Take my kids to school while I'm making big moves in it. Uh, and I'm chasing that dream. Eat beats just like cookies and ice cream. Coco ho on my team like iced tea. Watching games course I just like Spike Lee. So you should do the right thing and direct all that hatred to somebody else. And if you got beef, I'm about to have a feast. And I eat that shit all by myself, bitch. You ain't got more hunger than me. Oh, you ain't got more hunger than me. Oh, you ain't got more hunger than me. Oh, you ain't got more hunger than me. Maybe younger than me, more humble than me, and primal than me, more cunning than me. But no one thing if you come to me, what? You ain't got more hunger than me. Right, Liam's into uh, another fish. Uh, nearly, his rod nearly went in again. Came in quick, didn't it? Net's never ready. There's always somewhere else. Watch it on that bird. Better one in it. Right, I'll bring it up to the mat and have a look. Right, book came out in there. This is a common, it's a nice one. Got a dark colour. Well, I actually said it's a nice one, it's actually a nice one. So, Every fish in the nice one, man.
this is the stray cat that lives on the lodge in the shed. Uh, anglers are feeding. But, uh, when it's sunny weather, it comes out, sits with us. Uh, other people do feed it, I know some guy feeds it at the time. And he comes. So yeah, well I'll show you the random cat. Thick across the back. Yeah. Hard to get hold of. I had a fish before this, uh, but I didn't get on video because everything wrapped in in one go. Uh, little one again. Nice scales though. Let's get it back. So this is the uh, swim I usually fish in. Uh, I see what that blue air filter is. Let's zoom in on that. There, uh, I fish. Um, either about there or there, not too close because it's, it's a snag, but uh, it's usually pretty good. And also, it's pretty good uh, along these back trees here. Uh, that's an alright spot. And I've seen quite a few people catch carp just in that corner there. There, it's about a foot deep, not even that. And uh, people use a pole on the corner with a piece of meat on the bottom. And uh, catching quite a lot of carp there. So I'll have to give that spot a try another time. When it's a bit warmer on the floor. But yeah, that other guy we're fishing uh, in the camo. He's hard. Like he said he had seven carp. He was using meat. Uh, he's had a few bream. He's heading off now because uh, the forecast more bad weather. The rain stopped for now, but it's meant to come again about and now about four ish. 
but the fishing usually picks up about five ish anyway for car field. And uh, we are fishing till about six, seven o'clock. So hopefully we'll get some more fish. Let's get a better view of the way. Lake, lodge. Right, so this is the other lodge. Uh, I've only fished this one once, and I only got a carp left out of it. Just one. So we've got two carp fishing now, apparently. Uh, there's no other anglers on now. There was, but uh, we've gone. Where have we gone? Oh, yeah. Right, whilst I was getting a few scenery shots on other lodge, Liam had another fish, a mirror, and now he's just got into another fish. It's a little one. Wake up. Uh, what is it? The roach. On. Is that three grains of sweet can't it touch? It's a nice roach, isn't it? Put it on your nook in map. Probably what? It's where you are, a roach. Nice size, on. Three grains of sweet corn, look. It's not very common. Hey, wake up. Right, decided to put on the grain of sweet corn. That's what we're looking at. And uh, we've got a carp on. 
one spent now. Right, so Liam's had another fish, the battery's ran out on the camera. So, yeah, this is his fourth fish, I guess it's fourth carp, fifth fish. He had that roach. Looks a weird colour. It's like really faint, like a ghost carp or something. Yeah, another nice fish. A bit close. Yeah. Right, uh, got another fish on the cat food.
Quoi two for police scale mirrors before. I'll put one from here. Nice fit. Oh, hard work. Right, I've had another fish. I had a fish before this, uh, but I didn't get a video of everything wrapping in in one go. Little one again. Nice scales up. Get that. Right, there's another one. Uh, swim's going pretty good now. Getting the fish pretty quick. This is my ninth carp. This is a crucian. There's a lot of them. So it's a actual line. Still a bit hyper, I got it in pretty quick. As you can see, there's no barbules. Broad, I think it's got a flop. Uh, but yeah, nice fish. My first crucian from here. Liam's done, add out else. So yeah. Right, the uh, fishing's gone a bit quiet now. Um, weather's completely changed, come back to like a thunderstorm. And it's actually just starting to die down now. Um, now I've started recording. Yeah, we. <laughs> What was that? We were having a few umbrellas. <laughs> <laughs> a few umbrellas, bro. <problems. laughs> you asked one, I'll be under it. <laughs> yeah, you know what? Uh, you... <laughs> There's some West Ends coming now. <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, maybe we'll try to get some more. Hopefully, you might have been blown in. Oh. Right, I'm back home now. <clears throat> Weather got pretty bad. But uh, we're getting picked up anyway. Finished about 7 o'clock. I think I ended up getting about 12 carp, 12 or 11. Got a few of them. I didn't put on video because uh, they're about the same size. Carp. Um, Liam ended up with four carp. That rope. I did get a bream as well, but I didn't put that in an old um, So, yeah. From the weather conditions, so I did pretty good. It's most I've ever caught there. And that was Liam's first time fishing there as well, because uh, he's only just joined. And there is two lodges there, uh, I believe I've fished you one once. Uh, so if you did enjoy the video, leave a like rating, leave a widget. Uh, leave a comment if you have any questions. And uh, subscribe if you want to see any more videos. Don't know when I'll be next doing a video, but fishing anyway. I will be live streaming, started live streaming daily now. I'll put a link in the description on my Twitch account so it's easier for you to tune in so yeah hope you enjoyed it see you next time so, bye Jeff don't jump <laughs>